Don't waste your money this Black Friday. Nobody's going to tell you that. I swear to God, nobody's going to tell you that. Everyone's going to tell you how you can find some great deals and this is an exciting year and maybe that on 32 inch from Walmart would be a great buy or maybe the Spectre 32 inch for $88 would be a good buy. I'm here to save you some money. So if you like this, smack a like on the video because I'm getting to the point right now. So it's like this, guys, okay? This year has been one of the most abysmal years for TVs I've ever seen. If you are on a budget and you really just need a TV right now, buy yourself a Hisense H8G or H9G. Those two TVs will cover anybody looking for a premium TV or even a budget TV. You have no reason to look around or to try to look at anything else. I'm not sponsored to say that, it is just a fundamental fact after testing these TVs for you. So you don't have to waste your money. You don't have to buy this RCA on Black Friday sale. You don't have to buy this crappy TCL 3 series. You can get yourself a good TV. Even the Vizio M series, you might want to look at them, but they are known for being glitchy and buggy. So even if you see these good deals on the M series, I would pass because this year is like every other year with Vizio. They haven't fixed the bugs and the glitches. And honestly speaking, Hisense is offering more than any other brand this year. And the only brand that comes close is TCL with their 6 Series. And that's not even ideal because they have a lot of Black Crush issues. Then they have blooming issues that are really bad, motion issues. I could go on and on that have already done reviews on these products to just kind of put it out there for you guys. So if you're on the fence and that was what you were deciding between, there you go. Now... My official recommendation is to wait until next year. Guys, I know it's tempting, okay? But we are already in November, mid-November of 2020. If you can hold out for a couple more months, you're going to be seeing absolute juggernaut monster TVs launch. I'm hearing rumors of mini LED TVs, quantum dot TVs with uh, mini LEDs. Um, I'm hearing talks of quantum dot OLED, dual layer, full array local dimming displays. I mean, like, it's absolutely insane what we're hearing i'm hearing that hisense's entire h9 line is going to get a revamp to 4k at 120 hertz i mean i'm hearing crazy freaking rumors out there and if half the stuff is true at the prices that we're expecting i mean you're going to be having mega buyer's remorse for buying a hot buy tv like this phillips 32 inch from walmart when you could have cashed out with that same money. I mean, just save up a little bit longer, a couple more checks. I understand that like people are broke sometimes, you know, COVID hit everybody differently. I believe me, I'm there, I get it, I get it. But at the same point in time, don't be foolish with your money buying anything just to fill the void and hold yourself over. You're wasting money if you do that, and you're much better off taking the money you put onto a crappy TV like, let's say, this Hisense 43-inch H4 series or whatever it is, right? And just saving up and applying that to a better TV that will last the testament of time. That is my number one recommendation, and that is how I suggest you go about Black Friday. I know, again, every YouTuber is going to try to hype up Black Friday sales, slap a ton of affiliate links down below so that they get commissions off of your hard work. But at the end of the day, I'm not like that, and I'm really trying to save you money here. Do not fall into the 2020 trap. You will have buyer's remorse. I can't say it any clearer than that. If you have questions, maybe you've narrowed it down to a couple models and you just need help, I can help you honestly and unbiasedly. I want to thank you for watching the number one brand in honesty, and until the next video, I'll see you guys later.